This is the Ultrax controller. He's a 72 volt, 500 amp model. And uh, I've got my Anderson connector with my positive and negative. My negative goes there. My positive goes through the, through the uh, contactor, which we have plugged in to here. The negative wire is, and it says on it, black uh, BLK SOL negative. The positive of the solenoid goes to the B plus right here. And uh, our key switch also goes to our positive. So if I take off the key switch like that, the controller goes off, put the key switch on, and it will uh, do its little check and then turn on the lights on like that, which means it'll go. And as we see, there's our motor and he's ready to go. Uh, our motor wires, our, our B plus is shared with our uh, motor plus. And then this wire back here is our motor, motor negative. That goes to the negative. The B plus is shared. As you can see, he runs right over there. And this is the B minus. And he comes over here to the B minus. So a really simple controller. We have these two wires here that go to the throttle box. And they are labeled uh, J5 and J4 with throttle written on top of them. So that goes to our 5K potentiometer, which is right there. Uh, that starts at zero and goes up to 5K. 5K is full speed and zero is off. Uh, since this is a series motor, we also have a cable going from here over to here. So, now all this of course is not connected to the BMS. BMS is the, the other system. We can uh, use our relay to turn our key switch off and on if we want. We could, we could have our uh, relay go through here. Now the uh, BMS won't come on unless our key switch wires are connected in and out. 